The story of Daniel in the lion's den is one of the most well-known and inspiring stories from the Old Testament. It takes place during the reign of King Darius, who ruled over the Persian Empire. Daniel was a Jewish man who was appointed as one of the top administrators in Darius's government because of his wisdom and integrity. However, some of the other officials became jealous of Daniel's position and sought to find a way to get rid of him. They convinced King Darius to pass a decree stating that anyone who prayed to anyone but the king for 30 days would be thrown into a den of lions. Daniel, being a devout Jew, continued to pray to God three times a day, as he always had done, even though it was now against the law. The officials caught Daniel praying and reported him to the king, who was heartbroken that he had been deceived into signing the decree. Despite his best efforts, Darius could not find a way to save Daniel from the punishment that his decree required. Daniel was thrown into the lion's den, and a stone was placed over the entrance to the den. But miraculously, God sent an angel to close the mouths of the lions so that they could not harm Daniel. The next morning, Darius came to the den and called out to Daniel, who replied that he was unharmed. When the stone was rolled away, Darius saw that Daniel was indeed alive and well, and he was overjoyed. Darius then commanded that the officials who had plotted against Daniel be thrown into the den of lions themselves, and they were devoured immediately. The story of Daniel in the lion's den is a testament to Daniel's faith in God and God's power to protect his people. It is also a reminder that sometimes we may face persecution or punishment for our faith, but God will always be with us, and we can trust him to see us through even the most difficult trials. This is the end of this episode. Follow for more content.